Today we will learn basic Niagara fluid. Let's create new project in 5.3 version. Enable Niagara fluid plugin. And restart the project. Create Niagara system. Burst particles and give some values. This emitter will be source particles for fluid. Add grid 3D gas emitter. Disable sphere source and change as a emitter type. And put the name of emitter. Name is empty but it is not working. Why? You need to change as a GPU mode. Add set fluid source attribute module to source emitter. Then now fluid is appearing. Enable temperature. Then you can see the flame. Disable sprite renderer to not see the particles. Flame is too much go up. Go to simulation, reduce the gravity. How to remove smoke. Go to source and disable density. How to change smoke color. Go to render and change the smoke color. How to change flame color. Change temperature's black body to curve. Then we can change the color. We will change shape location as a torus in source emitter. But fluid is not appearing. Cause fluid rendered in bound box area. So let's move particles location. Then it works. Let's see fluid in skeletal mesh. Add skeletal mesh location module. And spawn particles. And set skeletal mesh. Go to source and reduce the temperature scale. Then it looks more fit for skeletal mesh size. In skeletal mesh location module, set as a surface. So particle is spawning in random position in surface. Let's see in viewport, set like this. And if you play it, you can see fluid is spawning in skeletal mesh. But fluid resolution is not good. We can make it better in Niagara system. So go back to Niagara. Go to simulation and reduce the resolution max axis values. Then resolution is become more not good. If you increase this value, then resolution is good. But you need high quality GPU card. So, if you have high quality GPU card, then you can see good quality of fluid. Thanks for watching.